Hey guys, Zogarvis here, and I'm back for another episode of Fire Emblem Three Houses. Last time, we pretty much just got to the end of this, uh, at the end of this month, and, uh, this time, we are going to start our mission. Um, but first off, we actually do need to do some support, uh, stuff. So, um, I forgot to do my support missions, uh, beforehand. I, I said I was gonna do them last episode, but I guess it's fun to do them this episode. So, yeah, let's start off. Claude wants to talk to Raphael. Oh boy. Why does like every single support mission with Raphael start off with him panting? <laughs> there we go. Time for a break. Hey Raphael, that's quite a load you've got. There. Okay, well, mm, I wasn't gonna say anything, but uh, Claude already did. Okay. It was my turn to do the shopping again, but I might have overdone it. Aren't those trips usually for food supplies? Why did you pick up a bunch of spears and gauntlets as well? I was passing by the smithy, and the old man called me over. He said he was finished repairing the training weapons, so I grabbed them since I was already there. I see. And those books? I had just left the smithy when I ran into a merchant I recognized. He said he had some books that he brought for the library, so I took them off his hands. Right. And that desk? <laughs> oh, this? Can you believe someone threw this away? It only needs a little work and it'll be good as new. Someone around here was just saying that they needed a desk. Uh, of course. Now, this is just a friendly observation, but I see surprisingly little of the food supplies that we actually need. <laughs> <laughs> well, oh my God. I uh, worked up an appetite from carrying oh all this God. stuff. So, uh, I had a snack on my way back. Raphael, I appreciate the thought, but you can't get so carried away with helping out like that. You helped us all right out of dinner. And now that I've seen your struggle, I have no choice but to join in this vicious cycle of charity. Here, I'll lend you a hand. All of this stuff is pretty heavy. Are you sure you can handle it? You insult me. And, <laughs> no, I can't. I'll only carry the books and offer my support as you handle the rest. Ah, <laughs> oh, Claude. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, my God. Lawrence is so many... <laughs> so many skill trees. Jesus, okay. Ignatz, let us take a short break. I will pour tea. Please, choose a teapot for us to use. You want me to pick one? I don't see any other Ignatz around here, do you? Go on now, we're wasting time. The pots are over here. I will leave the selection to your judgment. Ah, let's see. How about this? That's rather plain. <laughs> Why did you choose that one? The tea you chose has a very subtle taste, as well as a smooth, light texture. Such an unassuming tea calls for an unassuming pot, and one that complements the tea's color. In addition, the pot oh I selected God. has a floral design. Although we can't go for a walk today, we can still bask a little in nature's beauty. Very interesting. You know, you have an absolutely marvelous aesthetic eye. Precisely what I would expect from the son of a merchant house that has enjoyed the Gloucester's patronage for so many years. After we graduate, when you begin your trade in earnest, I will introduce you to my father. Oh, that sounds wonderful. But I'm afraid I'm already on the path to becoming a knight. Ah, right, you are a second son. Still, oh. <laughs> your eye for beauty is a talent that should not go to waste. Very well. If wow. you are to be a knight, then I shall happily take you into my service. Ah, well... Hmm, what, does that displease you? Not at all. I just need a little time to think it over. Ah, <laughs> uh, that was cute. His eye for the arts is unwavering, but in all other matters he is woefully indecisive. Ignatz is my homie. <laughs> oh, right. He has like Oh no. <laughs> oh, I can only imagine how wrong this is gonna go. Oh boy. Lysithia, do you have a moment? There is a matter of significance I'd like to discuss with you. I know you're always seeking the attention of ladies, but why are you wasting your breath on me? Don't be silly. I want to discuss the future of the Alliance, to have a constructive and candid exchange of opinion. I'm not 
so sure I'm the one being silly. Actually, I'm busy. Stuff to do. Now, hold on just a moment. House Ordelia will never benefit from such a narrow-minded mentality. I was under the impression you were interested in me as a person. What do house matters have to do with anything? As it stands, the bonds between Alliance Lords are quite weak. If this state of affairs persists, I'm afraid those bonds may dissolve entirely. I couldn't care less. Oh, damn. <laughs> Colisithia. <laughs> house Ordelia may be small, but a small house is fettered by fewer obligations than a larger one. Apply yourselves actively in diplomacy, negotiate wisely, and you could do much to help maintain peace among the neighboring lords. The recognition of those lords would benefit your house immensely. Lysithia, just, just walk away. To that end, why not start with oh my me, God. the heir to House Gloucester? It couldn't hurt for us to become friends, could it? Yes, yes, of course, when the time comes. But right now, I'm quite busy. Maybe later. There we go. She actually responded politely. What the hell is happening? <laughs> As it is, I'm studying magic for the benefit of the Alliance, and I would appreciate it if you left me to it. Ah, I see. Then forgive the intrusion. I will take my leave of you for now. But if there is any way I can be of help to you or your house, I hope that you won't hesitate to ask. After all, as I'm sure you know, the future of the Alliance is my responsibility. <laughs> the future, he says. Hm. As though I have a future. What? Wait, what? What? That was unexpected. What? Aww. And so I have a future? Ah, I really like how, like, everything is going into, like, so much of a deeper, um, like, thanks to their, uh, what is it? To their, like, actual characters. So, like... Like, I didn't know that Lysithia was, like, insecure about her future until now. And maybe they'll go deeper on that in their, uh, in their support, like, later on. Ah, that's so interesting! Thank you, Fire Emblem! <laughs> Tell me, Marianne, do you have a love of flowers? Um, well, I don't dislike them. I've happened upon a spot that's just teeming with splendid blossoms. Would you like me to show you? I think I would rather stay. It would be for the best if you kept your distance from me. Well, perhaps I could pick a few of the nicest and present them to you. With a beautiful bouquet in your arms, your magnificence would rival even that of the goddess. I would never compare myself to the beauty of the goddess. Oh. <laughs> yeah, you kind of fucked up there. I see. Well, I don't mind. Oh, that is a lovely handkerchief you've got there. Did you know that a handkerchief reflects the sensitivity of its owner? Yours tells me you have quite a refined sensibility. Oh my god. Lawrence, <laughs> come on, man. If you only applied yourself a little more to the rest of your ensemble, uh, there is no doubt uh, in my mind. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god, Lawrence. I'm going to fucking kill you. If you admire my handkerchief so much, you may have it. <laughs> No! <laughs> no! Or else why? Why? <laughs> no, please. That is not what I meant. It was a gift from my adoptive father. I didn't choose it for myself. <sighs> oh no. I'm sure I don't share his refined sensibilities, though, considering how little he and I have in common. I have to go. Such beauty. And yet, with just a little polish, she'd be a marvel. Shut up, Lawrence. Hmm. I wonder. Indeed, I shall make it my mission to awaken her beauty. Uh, okay, yeah, alright. There is nope. nothing that I... No, nope. shut up. <laughs> Come on, Lawrence. <laughs> Seriously, man. <laughs> well, alright. <laughs> no sort of missions. Okay, let's go to the real mission now. Alright, the Gautier Inheritance. A group of thieves less led by a disowned son of uh, House Gautier has has stolen a hero's relic and began to has and has begun to run amok. 
See, seeking to neutralize this threat, the church is sending your house there to se uh, settle the matter. All right, here we go. The Gautier Inheritance, White Clouds, Chapter 5, Tower of Black Winds. Say, Teach, this must be the tower, don't you think? You know, even for a tower, it's pretty, um, uh, you know, towering. <laughs> that was such a good delivery! Oh my god, I have, oh, uh, man, I really have to praise, uh, what is it, Cla Claude's voice actor, whoever it is. Jesus. <laughs> it would prove difficult to attack. It's a remnant of ancient wars. Those thieves certainly found themselves a great place to nest. I hear their leader Miklon is a former noble. It makes sense that he would already know about this place. Several hundred years ago, this was an important stronghold for defusing invasions from the north. Back then, this tower was built for both surveillance and defense. It will be difficult to seize it. Gilbert, isn't it? You hail from the kingdom, right? No wonder you're so knowledgeable. While we're chatting so amicably, do you mind if I ask some questions? I don't mind. If I can answer them, I will. Have you ever seen the Lance of Ruin? I have. A long time ago. It was an impressive, if not eerily ominous weapon to behold. According to Margrave Gautier, Miklon has used the Lance to turn the tables on his pursuers. Is that right? Then those without a crest can use it as well. Interesting. As far as I knew, that wasn't possible. And then we have the mythical sword of the creator, which can't be used by anyone except Teach, crest or no crest. Maybe you're just that special, Teach. Or maybe there's something you're not telling us. Either way, I expect big things from you in this battle. Leave it to me. <laughs> I love a good show of confidence. I'll do my best, too. You can count on it. Uh, the rain is really coming down now. Let's finish this quickly. Alright. Okay. So, um... I'm just gonna check around the map, because why the hell not? So, um... So this is Sylvain's brother, and he does look like him. Um, alright. So this is like a spiral, huh? Or maybe not? Hold on. Yeah, so it goes this way, it goes up here, to the left. Man, this is a really linear battlefield. I mean, okay. Uh, that might not be the best, but... Oh, it looks like there's actually gonna be people coming from behind. Because look at this. That's... That means that, uh, enemies were killed there. So that definitely means that, I think, uh, there's gonna be reinforcements. So I just need to watch out for that. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Oh, Gilbert's here. Okay. Um, all right. Let me adjust our team. Okay, that looks good. All right. So, uh, I, I don't think there's anything else. So let's fight. The enemy is close by. We're almost to the top floor. <sighs> Why did we have to climb so high before a battle? Eh, at least it's better than fighting in heavy rain. Don't hold back for my sake. My brother is going oh. to pay for everything he's done. Oh, okay. So my, my friend told me... Um, so I, I recruited Sylvain for the memes, but apparently he does have, like, a lot of, um... A lot of, like, personal quotes. And, um, he told me that I should, uh, f have Sylvain fight, um, whatever his name is. Uh, shoot. I don't remember his name, but his, uh, brother. So, yeah, I, I might try to do that. Okay. So, um, yeah, we're gonna have to go and bait them in right now. Yeah, he can take two shots there. 
Um, let's just have everyone move forward. Me? Ready and willing. Okay. So, Raphael should be able to tank this pretty easy. Okay, alright, Raphael. Alright, buddy. Okay. We're just gonna power through this. Alright. <laughs> okay. Uh, <laughs> wow. I cannot believe you just crit on his first fucking hit. What the? Why? What? What? Should have trained better. I, 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 <laughs> Raphael, come on, man. I want some XP for everyone else. He's literally my highest level. Uh, not highest level, but almost my highest level. Seriously? Uh, such a pain in my ass. Oh my god. What the hell is that? Oh, I don't get it. Come on, man. <laughs> Uh. Okay, enemy phase. Up, oh, yep. I'm not very surprised. In trouble. Hurry up, you fools! Enemies approach from the lower floors. Watch the rear flank. All right. Is he gonna go back? Please don't go back. Okay, thank God. Okay, so that should be fine, actually. Um, they're just two sorties. They won't do anything. So, um, there's that. He probably has a key. Um, so I, mm, who should I send? Probably Lorenz. Lorenz and like maybe Leone or something like that. Uh, Leone seriously needs levels though. That's really a problem right now. Um, but let's bait in with Raphael. Oh, wait. Okay. Oh, I really need to be careful with this because magic, ugh, that's a big no-no. Oh, oh my god, what the hell is happening, Raphael? Come on! <laughs> I mean, I don't want him to get that, but come on, man. Why is all my luck going to you right now? Oh, why? Why? I mean, honestly, this kind of works. Um, do I really want him to get him from me? Uh, uh, I don't really think we can help it too much. Uh, but who do I want getting this kill? Attack. That works. Um. Actually, let's. No, group flames would be a complete waste there. Uh, let's just one shot him. I don't know. I don't really want to use that. I'm gonna use my steel sword if anything. Uh, if I have to use something. So yeah, let's just do that. All right. Should I have held back? And this should be good. Okay. Actually, interesting idea. Uh, we can have we can have Lysithia go or Lysithia go here and try and bait in someone. Or actually, let's do Ignatz. Uh, yeah. Let's have Ignatz wait. Uh, items. Let's see if he can equip something. Okay. Yeah, we should be good here. But yeah, let's just have him wait here. And yeah, that should be good. Uh, I'll give support as well if he needs it. And that should be good. By the way, i if you couldn't tell, I am um, I am editing a lot right now, uh, just because I feel like it would go a lot easier if this happened. Wait, oh, he goes. Oh, he has extra like range or something like that. Okay. Oh, gotcha. I cannot lose. I cannot lose. <laughs> oh, he's so dead. <laughs> Jeez. This is my duty. They both tried to attack him and both failed. Wow. All right, come back up. So, uh, yeah, I'm definitely trying to. Uh, let's see. Let me take less damage. I think Lawrence. Um, but I am trying to really. Uh, like, speed the battles up, make it go quicker, something like that. But can we really not attack him? Yeah, it doesn't look like it. Well, that kind of sucks. But, oh well. A lot of this battle is really just moving around, so it, it isn't really 
too much of a, of a like a, a hassle. Oh wait, did he? Oh, am I not gonna be able to move them? <laughs> well, that's gonna be annoying. <laughs> All right, whatever. So there is an armor guy, armored guy. So uh, Hilda should come in complete use there because she has uh, the mace. Yeah. So that does a lot against. Um, was it heavier armored units? So we should be good on that front. Um, but can we move these guys? Up, oh, we can attack, but holy crap, I am not doing that. Um, um, that's actually kind of not good. Uh, wait, 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 wait. This is actually really bad. Holy shit! What do I do here? Um, I guess just do as much damage as possible, uh, Leone. And then can Lorenz finish him off? Please. Oh my god. Oh! Oh! Please hit. Oh, thank god. He probably would have killed Lorenz there. Oh boy. Okay, I probably shouldn't have my units like that, like, uh, really low leveled units go off on their own. Holy shit, that scared me. Alright. Oh wait, they're okay. Here we go. Attack them from both sides. It's an ambush. Y you're not here. <laughs> oh, well, I mean Okay. <laughs> uh that actually is not good. Okay, so I need to watch out for more of those corridors. Or corridors, however you want to say it. Wow, there's a lot of people. Oh wait, why, why are we in that range? Ah, uh, well, I mean, it doesn't. Uh, okay. <laughs> All right. Well, I mean, I guess he's just completely overpowered right now. I I wonder if he's gonna die. He's raising some death flags, like the way that he's being super, like dummy thick overpowered. I don't know. <laughs> okay, so is he gonna go backwards? No, he will not. That's fun. But uh, we should be able to take care of this pretty easily. Let's see, how much can I do here? Oh, wow, that's a lot. <laughs> yeah, why not? You're pretty dead. Damn. Each battle, a chance to grow. Level 12, nice. Such power dwells within. And we should be able to take care of the next one. Uh, let's see, who should take it? Ah, uh, Hilda, why not? Okay, never mind. That is why not. <laughs> Can you one shot, though? No, that is a big no. Although, yeah. Let's just do this and then Marianne can finish him off. <laughs> wait. 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 <laughs> Alright, well, that. That's really awkward, but it's fine. <laughs> I cannot believe I just did that. I am an actual idiot, and I deserve to die here. But I will not, hopefully, um, just attack with silence too. Um, foes hit are unable to use magic for one turn. Oh! Shit, that's really good. Okay, well, just go. Okay. I can't afford to lose. And we might have to run. How much are you gonna do? Okay, that's a lot of damage. Holy shit. We are going to run. <laughs> that is what we're gonna do. And then how much resistance do you have? None! Wow, that's fun. And then can Raphael even make it out? Uh, let's see. So how much damage would you do to Raphael? Actually, pretty much nothing. Um, what the hell? <laughs> what is this? There's a rogue over there. Uh. Uh. I can't do that, can I? Oh, yes, I can. Hmm. Should I though? <laughs> Should I though? Screw it, I'm going balls deep. Alright, Raphael. Alright, buddy. 
You got this. You're a champ. Come on, man. You've got this. <laughs> and then everyone else is gonna come forward. And oh wait, I should have used healing on uh, on him. Oh well. Oh, even more. T hey, buddy. Yeah, honestly, Ravo can pretty much take care of himself <laughs> at this point. Um, although maybe that's a bit much. <laughs> we might have to run here. Okay, they are all coming. Yeah, we definitely need to run. Oh boy. Yeah, he just needs to keep running, running forward. Good, he's he's rejoined with us. Now, okay, we should be fine here. Let's just go on the opposite side here, kill him, and then. Leave. I'm on a roll. Nice. Should have trained better. Level 12 for him. Oh boy, I need to stop him for leveling, leveling him. Proud. Okay, that's just one of the steel gauntlets. He should be fine though. Um, all right, and then we can just kill these guys. Um, yeah, let's just shoot. Uh, let's go on the other side and shoot him. Just to get in as much as I can and uh, be as close to Raphael as I can. Let's see. So Hilda definitely take this kill. I need Hilda to be very good because she she needs to be one of our carries throughout this uh, game. Just because like she's <laughs> people have been telling me how good like how goddamn good she is. So uh, there's that. And um, let's have I like to do this. Why not? And let's not use our uh, fucking thing. <laughs> Um, Dark Spikes... Eh, I can... Mary... Mary... Ah, uh, no. I'll just have... Sylvan go in... Real quick. <laughs> oh, and he missed. Nice. And we should be good. I... I need to just get rid of her bows because they are completely useless. I wonder how much more I can learn. Like honestly, that was uh why does it auto to that? Or like default to that. That's so annoying. Oh well. Let's just go over here for protection and we just walk forward. They have, a, wait, they have items on them, all of them. What the hell? Or not all of them, but a lot of them. Okay, well, there's that. Uh, this could be actually kind of bad. We, have, we just have to play our cards right here. Um, okay, so there's a lot of people here. <laughs> and they are going after Raphael. It's fine, honestly. You're not using, yeah, you're not using any battalions, so that should be completely fine, if I'm gonna be honest. Uh, so let's just put everyone just right next to him. But we should probably just use a vulnerary, and this should be good enough. Oh, and we also need to equip our gauntlets, uh, at least those ones. And let's use our vulnerary there, and reposition everyone. Alright, enemy phase. Yep, here they come for Raphael. <laughs> he takes no damage, great. That's fine by me. Oh, wait, I didn't realize that was in range. Oh well. Alright, should be fine, hopefully. Uh, we might actually have to back up a little bit. Other than that, I don't know. Yeah, way too many of us are in range right now. So how much damage? Okay, I see. Uh, we're gonna go after Ignox. Honestly, we can just take them right now. Okay, they're gonna kill Marianne if we don't act on this though. Um, so, okay, we are not having 
let's see if they go there. Okay, by the way, I need to... I need to unequip that. Just like... Hold on, can I discard? Okay, awesome. Awesome! Ugh, that was... That was gonna get on my nerves if that happened any more times. Wait, I have fists now? Oh my god. Why? I... I literally just want to play this magic and that's it. Why? Oh boy. Okay. We will have Claude finish you off. It's not luck, it's fate. And vulnerary. Um let's send one of these. We don't need any beginners right now. Uh beginner seals right now. And this should be good. Uh yeah. Second. Uh someone's gonna attack her if I do that. Yeah, who are you attacking right now? Yeah, that's fine, that's fine. Oh boy, are there any spellcasters though? Honestly, if there aren't, then I think we're we kinda win this, just like no matter what. Um I don't think we lose anyone right here. But uh let's put Tilda in. And this should be good. Nice. Sorry, did I hurt you? Level 10 for Hilda. I think. Yeah, I'm definitely tougher. And a vulnerary, another one, wow. Um, should be good for everyone. How are you going to reach me? You only have an iron bow. <laughs> oh well, let's just use, an, use let's just use a vulnerary on Ignatz. Why not? And we should actually have these two cover our flank. Because I don't want it to be too much of a struggle, and they probably won't do much in the team fight up there. So yeah, let's just do this. So they're gonna come in. Oh shoot! Wait, what? I, I, I mean, they, they didn't do anything, but like, what? I thought that they weren't gonna use any battalion, battalions. Oh well. Huh. Well, at least didn't do anything. <laughs> okay, this. This could be bad though. We need to protect Marianne at all costs. And Lysithia for that matter. Just both of the mages. <laughs> oh my god, never mind. Gil Gilbert's just here. Gilbert's here. <laughs> oh boy. And Hilda, you cannot go in there. You cannot go in there. Okay, how many people are targeting? That's actually a lot of people. Okay, so going after Hilda. Ferdinand, or not Ferdinand, whatever your name is. Honestly, everyone here is pretty good to go. Um, although, yeah, I can't do that, of course. But, uh, how about we just kill this guy? Or wait, no. Um, I guess I can go in, completely destroy this guy. I have four times? That is absolutely ridiculous. Holy crap, what is happening? So we're just gonna put you here and then uh, hopefully you'll tank. Okay, yeah, you really, you seriously did not need to tank or like a uh, crit there. And we got a vulnerary. Jesus. This is actually kind of ridiculous. Okay, so we will use. Yep, mace. Oh, that's so satisfying. And there we go. Nice job, Hilda. You lost to me? There we go. Another vulnerary. Okay, so they just all have vulneraries, I think. Um, actually, okay, <laughs> that's fine. Honestly, this is all pretty fine. I just need to. I would like to heal. Ah, uh, uh, yeah, Claude, move like one, one little step, and heal. Yeah, let's just do this. Okay, and then we can. Probably just focus on this over here. Actually, uh, this is fine, right? I can just do no, no combat, all right? Yeah, we should be good. We should be good. Okay, I'm worrying myself too much. Um, I do want uh, Leone to get the kill here. So there we go. Nice. 
So who I'll exactly is this guy gonna go for? That's my question. I'm um, you're going for okay, Lorenz. That's fine. That's fine. Okay, so we should be good. And your turn. And there we go. I was just about to level up again. You guys are gonna do absolutely no damage to <laughs> to Raphael. Jesus, he really is a early game champ. <laughs> What is with all these battalions missing? Uh, well, I mean, I'm not gonna. Play. Level nine for Lorenz. Nice. I am still far from my best. Okay. <laughs> Damn. Raphael is just a, like an actual champ right now, and you're gonna die. <laughs> This is my duty. And, um... We can go in here and then just, uh, use combat art. And, oh wait, can we not? Oh, oh, we can. That's awesome, but... Nothing really we can use out of it. Um, unless, actually... We can probably go in here and then attack... Use our steel sword then, yeah, that works pretty well. As expected. Okay. Um, I'll just kill this guy, why not? All right, there's literally no reason why you should get all these crits. That's, this is ridiculous. I know you have a 22% hit, like, crit, but like, still, that's 20, that's only 22. It isn't all that much. Okay, so I kind of want to kill you, so... Uh, yeah. Let's just... Let's just yeah. <laughs> I just worked harder. Level 10 for Lysithia. Nice. I don't have time for failure! And... Uh, what's this guy holding, though? Accuracy ring. Okay, well, we can put Hilda over here and have her take care of that, to be, like, very honest. Yeah, why not? Okay. This is going pretty well so far, though. Much better than, uh, than the last one, because there was just so many mages and I couldn't keep up at all. Uh, but yeah, let's finish this guy off. Another nice job. Level 8 for Leone. Can't get comfortable. Okay, and then let us be cautious. You know let's just ah uh, no, let's just go all the way. Use our item. There we go. Oh wait, enemies aren't doing anything. Cool. Fine by me. <laughs> so Hilda, you can probably just go forth with us right now and then loop back around once that happens. Uh, once they get like. That once they charge in and all that. Alright. No enemy phase. Let's go. <laughs> okay. So, uh, we just beat them in. Or, we're, who is attacking us? Alright, that should be fine. We just go in and... I don't even know if you can do anything. So, a little tiny, like, tad bit. Uh, and you won't even be going for us if, or for Hilda if she goes right there. Okay, why not? No reason not to. Okay. Time for the lonely archer to try and kill him. Oh my god, he, she misses well. What the hell is happening? Alright, uh, who wants to kill her? Uh, should I? No, 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 no. I'm still, I'm way too overleveled to be honest. Uh, let's see. Sure, let's just go for it. And, uh, who should take the kill, though? Marianne? Maybe Marianne. I'll, I'll double check with everyone, though. So, who is, um, the lowest of levels? So, actually, the lowest level, honestly. Tie between Marianne and Claude, and honestly, Marianne gets the benefit of the doubt. Not benefit of the doubt, but she gets 
the better pick because Claude just has um, what is it? a uh, Claude has the XP bonus for his ability. So there's that. And Hilda, you start going down here. <laughs> you just one shot this guy, so. At least I think you one shot that guy. Alright. There we go. No enemy phase either. Awesome. Literally all this is is just me trying to track up this place. That's a lot of people that died. How did people die here? I don't understand. <laughs> Alright, Hilda. Um, just let him come to you. I guess. Yeah, let's just wait here. <laughs> and yeah, we do have the mace to strike back, so... I think he's just very dead, honestly. And, uh, let's just move these people. Uh, this is extremely boring, though. I wish that they made it so it was a bit more fun, and it, this, uh, map was a lot less big. Now's our chance. Uh, I'm not surprised they used a battalion, but, <laughs> I mean, it doesn't matter. <laughs> okay, ally face. No, please don't. Why? Why are you going that way? Oh, come on, man. Oh, wait, we actually aren't going to kill him. Um, well, that's awkward. That's actually very awkward. Um, Onslaught. I've got an idea. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, level 11. Hopefully she does not die. I, like, sincerely hope that she doesn't die. Um, yeah, yeah, we're fine, we're fine. Stop going for my kills, <laughs> God damn it, Gilbert. <laughs> um, but yeah, let's get let's get Sylvain near the front, and we should probably have Raphael wait. I think he needs to be like one of the first people to to engage on um on Miklon. So there's that if we ever need it. And also maybe I should um instead of doing horses, I should do just swords with Marianne. I'm not completely sure yet, but. That could be a possibility, because like that that was what she had before, but I wasn't really feeling it with uh, her kit, but I don't know. Uh, tell me what you guys think, honestly. Uh, here we go. No, wait, that means you could go in. Okay, it's fine. It's fine, it's fine. I thought he was going to kill him. <laughs> I was about to be very, very upset. Please, wait. Wait! Wait! You're kidding me. Wait, please tell me the allies go before the enemy. They do, right? Wait, 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 hold on. Okay, so the rogue waited. Um, we might actually have to go back in time. So Gilbert dealed 18 damage. Oh my god. Are you serious? Do I really need to... Because it's gonna be the... It's gonna be the rogue's turn next! You've gotta be... You've gotta be kidding me, right? You've gotta be kidding me! Uh, You know what? If he dies, then I'm gonna turn back the time. But if he doesn't, then... Uh. Like, seriously, what the hell is that AI? Uh, let's just wait here and get some XP, why not? Uh, well, this is gonna be a stressful next turn for literally no reason at all. Okay, please. Okay, they're gonna kill him. Oh my God. I have yet to be forgiven. For now, I must retreat. Should I let this go? Oh, I don't know. Oh my God. 
god. Like, seriously, that's such a dumb AI! Uh... Seriously, that is so dumb! I, I don't know. Oh, why? Why would you do that? I don't understand. Why is the AI so dumb? Oh, well. Let's probably let Claude get this XP little thing. And yeah. Oh my. I'm so fucking bummed out now. That's so annoying. Like, seriously, I. I did not deserve that. Oh, those three will be out of. Out of this, but. Uh, that's so, so aggravating. Okay, so let's see. How much damage would I do? Oh my god, actually. Holy shit. Um, yeah, actually. Yep, we can just win pretty much right here. But still, that's so dumb. <laughs> we got some XP. Cool. Hopefully it doesn't change the story, like, at all. But I, I don't know, man. Oh, well. And, and my turn. And we should be able to go in, right? Uh, okay, he's gonna take a lot of damage and do practically nothing. Whatever. Why have you come, you crest-bearing fool? I'm here for the Lance of Ruin, Miklon. Hand it over. I don't want to humiliate you, but I will. <sighs> Hurry up and die already. If not for you, if it hadn't been for you... Shut up! I'm so tired of hearing that! You've always blamed me for something that isn't my fault. Oh boy. Alright, that's fine. You didn't need to do anything really, but... <laughs> now it's time for uh, <laughs> him to die. Hello. Hello. So, you think you can take the lance from me, huh? I'll kill you. I'll kill every last one of you! Really? That, that's interesting. I think you're dead right now. Um, but... I mean, good, good theory. <laughs> oh boy. <clears throat> Not bad for your kind. A bunch of spoiled, rotten children. Oh, what is that? <clears throat> You're dead, my dude. That, that isn't good. What is that? Is it taking over his body? Oh. Okay, we're finding a fucking monster now. Um. What the? Big one? Is that you? Wait, I thought this battle was over. I. Okay, I'm not putting him into fight at all. Form. Oh my. Monsters. Is this your first time fighting such a thing? Then listen well to what I say. Oh my god. That's a lot I have to learn. Okay. An evil power has caused them to grow quite large. Their life force is beyond a mortal like yourself. You cannot win unless you fell them twice, or even thrice. Really? Okay. Even if you've cornered one, you cannot let your guard down. Those things are even worse when threatened. Really? Wait, wait, even what? Even if you've cornered one, you cannot let your guard down. Those things are even worse when threatened. Oh god. So is this like a like a mini boss or like Can you see that barrier? 
It is surrounded by great power. You must break through to fight that thing. A strong attack or gambit might help to break through more quickly. If you can break the barrier, that power will have nowhere else to go, and that will likely cause confusion for that thing. It cannot counter while confused, which means that is the best time to attack. All right. If you break down all of their barriers, not only will they be confused, they will not be able to move for a short while. Without the power flowing around them, they will not be able to restore their barriers. You might even be able to get something from them. They have such might that they will not fear you alone. But a battalion could prove useful on that front. Really? Okay. <sighs> Attack them with a gambit to draw their attention and force them to target you. That doesn't sound like a good idea, but okay. Be on your guard when they have realized their full power. The damage caused at times like that is not contained to just one spot. Once they have charged some power up, their barriers will be restored. You really must pay close attention to those things. Uh, okay. <laughs> oh boy, um... <laughs> Oh, all right. Distract them with a gambit, or just take them down before they can attack. In any case, think carefully before you act. But you should be conquering that thing instead of talking to me. If you're out of questions, get over there and fight! All right. How awful. So the hero's relics are hiding a terrible power within. I can't even tell friend from foe anymore. And I feel for him, but... The best we can do now is finish this quickly. Yeah, um, this isn't, um, okay, uh, let's just go, okay, so, he can go, he can go that far, Jesus Christ, man, you can do a lot, okay, so he's gonna go, damn, I don't know what to do here, like, do I just have a few people go in? I, I guess so. Um, before they go in, though, I, can I heal her? Oh, I have Physic. Okay, I do have Physic. Um, I have to remember that. And I... Yeah, I don't know, man. <laughs> this is... Wow. Okay, so let's just go in with Raphael. That's good. Um, so you have, like, a charge or something like that. And you're gonna do that much to Raphael. That's fine. But you'd focus Tilda if I did that. And you'd come closer. Um, okay. I'm just gonna have Hilda go here. And I guess use the vulnerary. I just want. Ah, uh, man, I have to go by about this very strategically or else I think I might die. And also, just for the heck of it, heal him. I don't know. Why not? If I need them to go in, then I need them to go in. Level time for Marianne. All right, nice. Um, oh well. <laughs> All right. Um, I guess I'll have um. Uh, I'll have Lorenz on guard as well. Although he doesn't have a, uh, he's not a vulnerary. I can trade something. Okay, so I guess I will. Oh, trade with no. Sorry, I'm I'm uh, going about this very slowly. It's just I really really need to pay uh, attention here. So I can't trade anything there. Um, I have two vulnerabilities though. That sucks. Um, yeah, I can't trade that really. That sucks. Wait, can I not? Oh, I think that works actually. So let's just wait here. Oh boy. So scary as hell. Ha! You missed. Damn, imagine missing. Alright. So. Let's go in. Shall we? Oh my god. That's a lot. 
Um, so I have a band of monsters, okay. Interesting. Um, so what did he say? The disturbance that they'll get rid of his barrier or something like that? Um, I think so? Let's see though. Yeah, I guess I'll use it. Oh wait, what? I thought it said I wasn't gonna take any damage. What? Wait, I didn't use my battalion, what? Oh... That is very not good. Um... Okay. Um... Shit. What am I supposed to do here? Like, seriously? No... How far is that? Very far in the... <sighs> I guess I have to do that. Um... Wait... You have to go back. Um... Shit, this is really bad though. Okay, so I need to assist. Phys physic... Wait, okay. Okay, I can, I can, I can. Alright. All right, Marianne, thank, thank the Lord you're our healer. Okay, we should be good, though. Um, yeah, I don't want to go in. It's on your turn. Okay, gotcha. Thorns are brewing. Okay, so that only did damage to him. That's a lot. Holy shit. All right. Still again. Much needed. And then we can do a stupid amount of damage here. It's awesome. So yeah, let's just attack him. He missed. Oh my god. Let's go, Raphael. <laughs> All right. Um. Nice, we can do that. 12 damage is fine. Level 12 for Hilda. So you have another health bar, great. Um, okay. That, how, wait, you're focusing. Thank God, but um, yeah, I think we need these three in here, and that's really it. Um, everyone else, I just, I don't know. Um, yeah, we can't really have anyone else in here, can we? Or wait, can, can we actually comet art? Yo, yo, okay, that's kind of sick. That's kind of sick. Awesome, so we can just get some chip damage in. All right, good job, Claude. Um, and I guess the same thing for uh, Ig uh, Ignatz once you can get in. Um, but yeah, let's just end. Oh, this is actually kind of terrifying, though. Okay, so he is attacking me. I'm gonna have to heal myself again. All right. Oh wait. Uh. So I'm gonna have, what is it, Raphael go behind him and then use a, yeah, assault troop. Um, I, I can do that, right? Uh, let's see, so Gambit and then assault troop. Um, yep, I think that works. Gambit boost. Here's an idea. Please hit. Okay, good. Good, 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 good. Do we get like a barrier break? Yes, we do! Nice. Okay, so he's going to go for him. So I'm just gonna use this at a distance, and uh, I'm also going to heal myself again. Thank you. And, oh wait, wait, no, I do need to go out, get out of the way, I think, right? Uh, because, oh wait, no, no, he's only gonna attack Raphael. Okay, so I can just attack him for free, I think. 
should be how it works. I think. Oh boy. Level 13 for Hilda. Wait, did that get him out of confusion? Please don't tell me. Please don't tell me. Please don't tell me. Please. Don't tell me. Please. Okay, it didn't. Uh, that scared the life out of me. Okay. Thank God he did. Okay. So let's just go in. Combat art. Um, what would do more? Um, that or okay, this will do more. So let's use their brick shot. And this should be the last, the last phase of him. Um, and she will never go for us, I guess. Um, can we actually shoot from here? No, we can't. So uh, let's have Claude go in real quick. Um, do a combat art. Um, curve shot. Should be good. I wonder if we can kill him uh, this turn, actually. We might be able to. Um, let's see. Can Oh, uh, I don't think that can happen. Oh, wait. Wait, 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 wait. Why would I get a bunch of damage for that? Um, oh my god. This could go horribly wrong. Um, yeah, I'm probably just gonna use group flames and then I can, uh, and then Logo can go in. Um, yeah, that's probably the best thing I can do here. So let's use our Gambit. Let's do this thing. Gambit boost. In this situation. Nice. Authority level three. All right, and yeah, she's gonna target Slicithia now, but it don't. It does not Stay matter focused. because we're gonna kill him no matter what. Let's go. Oh, that was scary. Like legitimately scary. Holy sh. Ugh. <laughs> wow. Goddess, the beast oh, okay, is gone. Still alive. Yet Miklon and the Lance remain. We defeated him somehow. Let's grab the Lance and return to the monastery. Miklon. My brother. Aww. Glad I brought him along. MVP is Hilda. Alright. Hilda's motivation is maxed out. Oh. Uh, oh my god. My thank you so much. Ah. <sighs> His form was changed. It was as though that lance was swallowing him whole. Upon that sight, it makes sense that your students were upset. I wonder if those relics truly hide such power. Yet even still, that power seems familiar. That form as well. As one who wields the sword of the creator, does that mean you possess that power too? Demon Lord! Woo! <laughs> <laughs> uh. Professor, you have returned. The goddess is indeed generous with her divine protection. I have already heard Gilbert's report about what happened. See to it that you keep what transpired at the tower to yourself. People would lose faith in the nobles should rumors spread of one using a relic and transforming into a monster. All regions of Fodland would fall into chaos. We must avoid that at all costs. Please ensure the students who accompanied you understand that as well. Have I made myself clear? Yes, Mom. <laughs> His transformation into a black beast was nothing short of divine punishment from the goddess. Punishment for someone arrogant and foolish enough to use a hero's relic even though they were unworthy and unqualified. You knew? Oh, I should have asked the other question, honestly. Of course. That is why we rushed to recover it. Sadly, we did not arrive in time. The church will formally return the lance to House Gautier, if you would. Oh. You have my gratitude. I can see that I was right to trust you with this. Please report back. I will tell you of your new mission for the coming moon at that time. Man, 
Man. So is he dead? Nice work, Teach. It's thanks to you that we successfully completed our mission. As for Miklon, I wonder if he really believed he could wield a relic. Uh, hard to say, honestly. I bet he just wanted to get his hands on it, even though he knew he couldn't use it. Though I'm sure he wasn't counting on turning into a monster like that. I wonder if that monster represents another aspect of a hero's relics. What a strange and terrifying power. Seems so, honestly, man. The stories of misfortune oh. have followed the hero's relics since ancient times. Tomas, you've caught me by surprise. That's not easy to do. Though I suppose I should have expected to see our librarian in his library. I am sorry to intrude. I simply heard you speaking of the hero's relics. I can tell you more about them if you'd like. The story goes that Nemesis was corrupted by evil because of the sword of the creator. Other heroes also lost themselves by continuing to use the relics, transforming into black beasts with twisted souls. There used to be a great many records regarding the dark history of the relics. Used to be. They have been destroyed across all of Fodlan, stripped from their shelves, including those that resided at this very library. You make it sound like the church is covering up the truth. But now that you mention it, Rhea was very specific about not wanting anyone to find out what happened at Conan Tower. Hey, Tomas, why are you telling us all of this? It seemed like you were searching for answers about the relics. What is a librarian if not a guide in the search for knowledge? And not only have you been searching, but you have been doing so through the night. I would suggest you stop before the night's notice. And that is enough meddling for today. Please excuse me. <laughs> so I've been found out, have I? I suppose I do spend more time at the library than most students. But I won't stop. I can't afford to. Yeah, where are you after? Teach. You don't really expect me to tell you something so personal just like that, do you? Though, I wouldn't mind sharing if you were to tell me some of your secrets in exchange. I can't let this exchange pass without comment. Oh. If you're sharing secrets, perhaps <laughs> I can share one as well? Are you sure you Secret time! <laughs> I'd say you're the least likely to share secrets out of everyone at the Academy. <laughs> Coming from you, I'll take that as a compliment. After all, you're easily the student with the most secrets. I'm afraid you overestimate me. My secrets don't amount to much. But back to teach. Don't try to change the subject, Claude. We're talking about secrets. <laughs> your, who is your father? And why did you appear so suddenly as if from nowhere? Duke Regan's eldest son died in an accident. Having tragically lost other family members as well, he was without an heir. The Alliance would undoubtedly have been shaken if House Regan had lost its position of leadership. But then you showed up. Why did you return to House Regan? What brought you to the monastery? I would like to hear this at all as well. Oh boy, I'm trapped here. I have no choice but to surrender under your intimidating gazes. My dream, in truth, is a selfless dream, but I require power to make it a reality. When I learned about the power of my crest, I knew I had a chance. So I'm chasing that dream, to the bitter end, if need be. I came to this monastery because I thought I might find someone useful. Someone to help me on my path. Haha, <laughs> it's me! Let's go, guys! <laughs> so, what do you think? If you promise to help me achieve my dream, no matter what, I'll promise to tell you anything. I have my own dream to tend to. I pray that yours does not interfere with mine. What about you, Teach? If it's a noble dream, absolutely. I see. Well, now isn't the time to discuss this. You are still my teach, after all. <laughs> oh, boy. So much plot! <laughs> Professor, you have done well to complete such a difficult task. You have shown exceptional skill in leading your students. I am forever grateful for the safe return of the hero's relic. Just as I expected, you have mastered the sword of the creator. <laughs> Now then, I shall tell you about your mission for the coming month. Rhea, Archbishop. 
Huh? Sateth, what troubles you? Flane is missing. I cannot oh. find her anywhere. What? Wait, well, well, that's... That's bad. Professor, have you seen Flane recently? I have not. I have searched everywhere. Where could she be? She may be in danger. Oh, no, no, no. What am I to do? Calm yourself, Sedith. Professor, we shall continue our discussion another time. Oh. Well, where the fuck is Flane? That's not good. Flane had my first tea party with me. Come on. Come on now. Part one. White clouds. Horsebow moon. Rumors of a reaper. As cold air begins to creep in from the north of Fargus, Fodlin welcomes the riches of fall. The women spend their days reaping the golden fields, gratefully embracing the bounty the goddess has once again provided. The men venture into the wilds with horse bows and empty sacks ready to be filled with game. Huh, so does that mean that we're gonna have, like, fall time in, um, the monastery? If so, that's really cool. But, god damn it, why, why Flane? Come on! Flane is so adorable! <laughs> I mean, she may be a lolly, but like, come on! <laughs> I don't know. Received 5,000 gold from the Church of Seros as m funding for this month's activities. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Wait, can I see what that is? Ah, damn. Okay, what's on Saturday? Oh. As I believe you are already aware, it's been a Sedith's week. younger sister Flane has gone missing. At present, all we know for certain is that she has not left Garrick Mach. Flane is not the type of person to just wander off on her own without telling me where she is going. Yeah, I, I can agree though, that she is very obedient. We have searched the monastery thoroughly, but have found nothing. I am now mobilizing the knights to begin searching the town. Troubling rumors have been running rampant lately. I do not wish to consider the worst, but... Uh, troubling rumors? There are rumors of someone prowling the streets and attacking innocents night after night. The okay, Knights that's have fun. investigated the matter. They have not discovered any remains, nor have they found any concrete evidence. The people are panicked. They all insist someone called the Death Knight is coming to claim oh. their souls with his blade. There is no way she could have escaped unscathed oh, if she was captured by such a fiend. Where is she? Seteth, recall that impatience begets error. Please do your best to calm yourself. I think of your sister as family as well. You know that. You have my support. We will devote ourselves fully, mind, body, and soul, to recovering her. Professor, your mission for this month is to help find Flane. The knights have the town covered, so I ask that you focus your efforts on searching the monastery again. We do not have time to waste. You have your orders. I swear to God, if Flane dies. <laughs> what? Flane is missing? So, finding Flane is our mission for the month, I take it? Wait. Who's Flane? <laughs> Said it's little sister. Surely you've seen her flitting about the monastery. She is the girl who looks about the same age as me, but seems well beyond her years. Sedith is much older than Flane. He's always looking out for her. He must be worried sick. If I were to go missing, oh. I can't imagine what that would do to my brother. When searching for something, it's best to start by gathering information. Hopefully someone has seen Flane. Yeah, I guess it's gonna be our, our quest, or one of them, for free time. Ah, uh, man, please. <laughs> Wait, what's that on? Okay, I need to... Oh! <gasps> Fuck every single plot thing we've had. It's Petra time. <laughs> you have my thanks for giving me your spare time. I have gratitude. <laughs> uh... <laughs> I like how we're just, like, in the middle of a bunch of fucking plot, and now we're just like, yeah, tea party. 
Um, uh, let's see. Uh, you know, children have the mark. I'm not in agreement. Shit. <laughs> well, um, um, uh, yes. Okay, there we go. Okay. This is harder than I thought because I don't really know her. Um, let's see. You're doing great work. There we go. You like that. Okay. Nice tea time. I will be waiting happily for you to be inviting me again. <laughs> All right, Petra. <laughs> She's adorable. Oh well. <laughs> tea time. <laughs> no, that reminds me of playing now. Oh. It's music. Okay, well. Uh, Leicester Alliance Founding Day. What's on here? Rare monster sighting. Oh. Okay. Uh, Catherine's birthday. Okay. Um. And. <gasps> Let's go. <laughs> All right. Cool. Um. That I'm going to that. Uh, the party. And search for Flane. Oh, she better not be dead. Please don't be dead. I, I swear to God, Fire Emblem, if you say that she's dead, I will murder your children. <laughs> All right, let's just let's just do this. No, fucking no. Uh, boy. I just. <laughs> <laughs> Looks great on you. Play Cynthia. Play Cynthia. Uh, I just want to look at all these. Uh, Archer, Mage. Mage like looks the best for her as well. Ah, uh, Priest looks pretty good, but we're probably gonna have um, what is it? Marianne as a priest. Man, though, ah, uh, Flame better be alive. She's too adorable and she's a little kid. Come on, man. All right. Oh, well. Perfect. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> and, um... Oh, wait. Actually, yeah. Let's do Hilda. Now that I think of it. Um, yeah. Let's look at all of them for Hilda as well. Uh, mercenary, thief, armored knight... <laughs> I'm never gonna get over that. Uh, Cavalier, Brigand, which is what she wants. Uh, Archer, Mage, Priest, and Pegasus Knight. And yeah, of course we're gonna do Brigand, however you say that. <laughs> Brigand? Brigand? Oh well. I don't wanna look up another thing. <laughs> Shucks! I guess I did it. All right. Um, and we do have one for Marianne as well. I think we should do Marianne at least. Yeah, she's definitely one of the most useful units of ours. So, yep. Just look at all of them for her as well. Uh, <laughs> just looks so stupid on everyone. All right, Cavalier. Again. Uh, Archer, Mage, and Priest. Uh, wait. Wait, am I dumb? I think I'm dumb. Yeah, I don't have any, <laughs> I don't have any intermediate seals. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna get some. Let's see. Item shop. Oh, the music is still playing even in the marketplace. Jesus. Alright. Well, let's get some. We need, like, pretty much as many as possible, so, yep. No reason not to. Um, so, certifications. Marianne. And let's get it for you. Oh, boy. I actually passed? me every single test <laughs> okay and um, I'm thinking uh, should we do Claude 
or Ignots. Oh wait, we can't even can't even do Ignots yet. Okay. Well then, Claude, how about you? And then, yeah, Leonie is just beginner classes. Oh wait, have I even done Leonie's beginner? Yeah, I have. Okay. I I feel like I haven't done someone's beginner. Um, let's see. Have I not? Maybe. Okay, I, I have. Thank God. I was like, wait a second. <laughs> all right. So let's do Archer for you. Um, let me just check out all the outfits as well. Lord, wait, Lord. Um, a noble and powerful leader. This class excels at wielding a sword and has a high degree of authority. Oh. Well, <laughs> that's a thing. Um, but mercenary, thief, armored knight, uh, cavalier, brigand, um, archer, brawler, mage, and dark dark mage. Oh, so you can become a dark mage with uh with that as well, and then priest. Okay, interesting. So let's do Archer, of course. Here we go. No chance for us to really fail, but oh well. Good job, Claude. I did pretty well. It's like we just go into the ex the exploration and, and uh, what is it? And uh, Flynn's just like, hello. <laughs> um, <laughs> imagine. All right, explore the monastery. Uh, what do you think, Sothis? Oh my. Just one small girl who's gone astray has caused all this. We cannot let this stand. You must do all you can to find out where she's gone. Now ask around to see what information you can find. Come now, no time to waste. Alright, alright, gotcha. Wow, the, mu the music is still playing? Holy shit. Yeah, the game really just wants wants to be very serious right now. I mean, I get that completely. All right, let's see who's in our house. Yeah, and I really sucks that Flynn's gone though, or like missing. Hey. If Flynn were taken hostage, I expect we would have received demands from the culprit by now. Perhaps this is not a kidnapping at all. Do you suppose she could have simply run away? I. Uh... I want to get more support points with you. If so. that is the case, it is unlikely that we will find her anywhere in the monastery. That's true. Ah, man. Okay. Hey. Uh, someone who was slacking on their straining. Oh boy, that's not you though. Where could Flame have gone? Do you think she's really been kidnapped? I hear Tomas has been going around asking about her. But he's probably just worried like the rest of us. Though it wasn't just Flame. He was asking about you and Captain Gerald, too. Wait, what? Really? Interesting. Ah, man. Let's see. I like how the music is just always this, like, very serious and grim tone, though. It's interesting. I have thoroughly surveyed the entire monastery. And yet I have not found a single trace of evidence that suggests Flane was abducted. Perhaps we must seek out personal recounts rather than physical evidence. In any case, we must hurry before something terrible happens. <laughs> Sorry, I had to do that. I've heard the monastery is full of secret passages. If there is no sign of Flane's departure, it is possible that she used one of those. Whatever has happened, I hope she is all right. Thanks to do. Well, not thank you, but like, yeah. thanks for the support, <laughs> I guess. Flane is missing. We should split up and search for her. There isn't a moment to waste. We must find her before it's too late. Uh, I'm just gonna have a tea party with some people, but yeah, I do agree. All right, hey Claude. <sighs> No sign of her leaving the monastery, huh? That is, assuming we can actually trust that information. Oh, but I'm sure this space has no shortage of secret passages and hiding spots. True. 
For now, there's not much we can do aside from making a thorough search of the monastery. Let's ask around and see what we turn up. You never know who might have seen something. Alright, what's your quest? Can I ask you a favor? I wish we could do more for Flame, but since we've got no leads, our only option is to search the monastery with a fine-tooth comb. Someone must know something. No stone unturned. Gather clues about Flame by talking to different people throughout the monastery. If someone seems suspicious, you should check their room or other places they might spend time. <sighs> okay. <laughs> so we're just going to stalk some people. I'm fine with that. Okay, but... We're actually going to do that next time on Fire Emblem Three Houses. So yeah, I'll see you guys later. Take care, and goodbye. Ciao.